We had Kelly's return to form at Fiji J Bay, but return to winning in Tahiti's 55th win into the quarterfinals now. And during the interview, Kennedy battled for the first wave and nailed a big full rotation on the first maneuver, Pete. And it's going to pay off in a big way. First section, attacking that first section. It was a nice vertical, sizable set wave. And he finishes up, cleans it up, gets some nice little snaps on the inside. So he gives the judges something to think about at the end of the ride. Sometimes you get lulled to sleep if it's kind of mid, you know, because in the mid part of this wave, it did flatten out. But look at that. Just full rotation, lands clean, rides out clean, no hitches, no falling back, nothing. He stomped it. Judges love it. And that's why they're going to give it a good score. 7.67 for Stu Kennedy. A wild card who's had a whole year to battle against the world's best. So basically acting like it's his rookie season on tour. And he'll make that official and join the rookie of the year race if he starts in nine events. This is stop eight. As he's up again now, backing up the 7.67. Just a quick look and he's out. Just reflecting on what Kelly was talking about and losing in round five, you receive 4,000 points, but you get to the quarterfinals, you get another 1,200 more points as you watch again. Watch this replay, and it, it goes so on and so forth through semis and into the finals, of course, winning 10,000 points. But look at that. Gets the grab, grabs it, and then lands. Again, as a if you're going to critique errors immensely, and maybe why we didn't see it go excellent is that he did hold on all the way to the landing. And, you know, skaters will call that a safety grab. Like, right, you hold on for a little extra length of time. You don't want to see it when you're in the air. You do the grab, and then you release. So you land without it. But he did hold on. But good on him, because you know you need to make it. It's better to make it than not. He lands that thing. He did stomp it, which was good. But again, holding on a little bit too late through that maneuver when he actually connected back with the water will affect the score slightly if you're going to analyze errors to a T. And then the very end, again, that was kind of sleepy through the mid part. Um, and then those couple snaps just to finish, but he, you know, he kicked out nicely. High end of good, 7.67, great start.